This man and his children got the shock of their lives when the love of his life and the mother of his children disappeared out of nowhere. One moment she was there, and the other, she was gone. He searched for 20 years without a single clue. But then, all of a sudden, he got a mysterious phone call. A call that would tell him the truth. In a quiet suburban neighborhood, there lived a family that seemed to have it all. The father, Richard, was a kind and loving man, dedicated to his family and work. He spent his days at the office and his evenings coaching his children's soccer games. The mother, Evelyn, was a gentle and nurturing woman who was well loved by everyone around her. Together, they had two children, a boy named Jack and a girl named Emma, who were the apple of their parents' eyes. Their lives were filled with laughter and love, with days spent playing catch in the park, evenings spent dancing in the living room, and weekends spent exploring the nearby woods. In this blissful period, there was no hint of the storm that was to come. Richard and Evelyn were a model couple, always supporting each other in their endeavors and putting their children's happiness first. They celebrated every milestone together, from Jack's first steps to Emma's first day of school. Each memory was carefully preserved in a meticulously maintained family album, with Evelyn's delicate handwriting recounting the stories that brought those moments to life. Every summer, the family would take a road trip to a cabin by the lake. They would spend their days swimming, fishing, and having picnics by the water's edge. In the evenings, they would roast marshmallows by the fire and share stories under the stars. It was a time of pure magic and happiness and the children treasured these memories as they grew a bit older. Richard and Evelyn would often sit on the porch, watching their children play in the yard, and they would feel an overwhelming sense of gratitude for the life they had built together. They would reminisce about their early days as a couple when they were just two young lovers dreaming of the future. The years had only served to deepen their love, and they couldn't imagine life without one another. As years passed, an unsettling feeling crept into the family, dimming the once happy home. Richard noticed his wife Evelyn's subtle changes, but attributed them to normal stress. However, the unease persisted, casting a shadow over their routines. Returning home early one day, Richard found the house unusually quiet and Evelyn gone. Despite searching everywhere, she remained missing. The following days were filled with confusion and grief, but Richard refused to give up hope launching a desperate search. Months turned into years, with Richard eventually focusing on raising their children, Jack and Emma. Both grew into young adults, carrying the scars of their mother's disappearance. Despite their achievements, the void left by Evelyn's absence lingered, a constant reminder of what was lost. Richard spent nights pondering Evelyn's disappearance, unable to shake the memories of their lost happiness. Twenty years had passed, but he remained a constant in his children's lives, Jack thriving as a lawyer and Emma as a successful artist. One day the phone rang unexpectedly, stirring emotions in Richard as he answered cautiously. To his disbelief, it was Evelyn on the other end, apologizing and wanting to meet. Overwhelmed with questions, Richard agreed to meet at their first date's bar. As he awaited their meeting, he grappled with a mix of emotions and pondered how to handle the situation with Jack and Emma ultimately choosing to keep it a secret for now. As he walked into the dimly lit bar, memories of their first date came flooding back. Richard spotted Evelyn at a corner table, and for a moment, time seemed to stand still. She had aged, of course, but her eyes still held the same warmth he had fallen in love with all those years ago. He approached her hesitantly. Their eyes met, and tears filled Evelyn's eyes. Richard, I can't believe it's really you. They sat down together, and for a while they said nothing. Finally, Richard pulled away, the questions he had been holding inside bursting forth. Evelyn, why did you leave us? Evelyn hesitated, tears streaming down her face. I never wanted to leave you, Richard, but I had no choice. As she began to share her story, Richard listened in shock and disbelief. She explained that she had been living under a false identity, trying to escape a dark past. Her father was a mobster that was on the radar of the FBI for a long, long time. She didn't want to play any part in his criminal life. The man stole, murdered, and did every evil thing known to man. 
so Evelyn testified against him in court. Her help got him sentenced to life in prison, but he was still very capable of crime. The mob hunted her down, and she was in constant fear for her life. That's why the FBI gave her a new name and tried to give her a new life. After that, she met Richard and started a family, but the past caught up with her. Her father's henchmen found her, and she had to move and go into witness protection. That's when she was forced to make an impossible choice. To protect her family from the danger that pursued her, she had to disappear without a trace. For 20 years, she had watched from afar, unable to reach out or reveal her true identity. She had seen their children grow up, and she had longed to be a part of their lives. But the fear of putting them in harm's way had kept her silent. I couldn't risk your safety. I couldn't risk our children's lives. But now, she explained, the danger had passed. The threat that had driven her into hiding had been eliminated. Richard sat in stunned silence, grappling with the enormity of what he had just heard. The woman he had loved and lost, the mother of his children, had been alive all this time, hidden in the shadows. The years of grief were suddenly replaced by a whirlwind of emotions. Richard knew that he couldn't make this decision alone. It was time to face the unknown, to confront the pain of the past and the uncertainty of the future. He looked into Evelyn's eyes and made a decision. Evelyn, he said, his voice thick with emotion, it's time for you to come home. Together, they drove through the familiar streets that had once been the backdrop of their happy life together. As the house came into view, Richard felt a knot tighten in his chest. What would Jack and Emma think? Would they accept Evelyn back into their lives? He took a deep breath gathered his courage and led her to the front door. Inside, the house was filled with the warmth of family. Because both of Richard and Evelyn's children had started a happy family life of their own at an early age. Jack and his wife Sarah were visiting with their young son while Emma and her fiancé Tom were preparing dinner in the kitchen. Richard cleared his throat and all eyes turned toward him. Everyone. He began, his voice wavering, there's someone I'd like you to meet. As Evelyn stepped into the room, there was a collective gasp. Jack and Emma stared at her, their faces a mixture of shock, disbelief, and curiosity. They had been so young when she had disappeared, but there was something in her eyes that stirred a distant memory, a connection that had never been truly severed. Jack, Emma, Richard continued, this is your mother, Evelyn. The room was silent as the weight of the moment settled over them. Jack and Emma exchanged a glance, then looked back at the woman who had once been their whole world, who had vanished without a trace, and left a void that could never truly be filled. Evelyn stepped forward, tears streaming down her face. I know I can never make up for the time we've lost, she said, her voice trembling, but I want you to know how much I've missed you how much I've longed to be a part of your lives. I'm so sorry for everything I put you through. As she spoke, she revealed the truth about her past, the danger that had driven her into hiding and the impossible choice she had been forced to make. She told them about the years she had spent watching from afar, filled with love and longing, but unable to reach out for fear of putting them in harm's way. As the truth unfolded, Jack and Emma struggled to process the whirlwind of emotions that engulfed them. The pain of their mother's absence, the anger at her deception, and the confusion over the dark secret she had been hiding all battled for dominance. But beneath it all, there was a glimmer of hope, a flicker of the love that had never truly been extinguished. Slowly, tentatively, they began to ask questions, seeking to understand the woman who had once been their mother and the circumstances that had torn their family apart. As the evening wore on, the air in the room seemed to shift, and the distance between them began to shrink. It was as if they were rediscovering one another, finding the threads of connection that had been hidden beneath the pain of the past two decades. By the end of the night, there was still much left unsaid, and the road to healing stretched out long and uncertain before them. But as they stood together in the warm embrace of family, it was clear that they were willing to try, to take the first steps toward forgiveness and the possibility of a future together. 
As Richard walked Evelyn to the door, he knew that the journey ahead would not be easy. There were still so many questions to be answered and wounds to be healed. But as he looked into her eyes, he felt the same warm feeling that made him fall in love with her all those years back. And he was not the only one who felt this way because to Evelyn's big surprise, her children were standing right behind her as she put her hand on the door handle of her car. They both looked at her for a while and then did something amazing. She looked back at them with a nervous gaze, wondering what they were going to say. But they happily surprised her. They pulled their mother close to their chest and hugged her intensely. And that's when they said the following words, Welcome back, Mom. We love you. If this story touched you as much as it did us, you should watch this video. Girl screams every time she sees grandma's family picture. Mom turns pale when realizing why. Click here to get the full story.